Hey folks, here Rashna Ranade here, and I welcome you all to our Thursday live stream. Uh, first of all, uh, I'm a bit tired today, but I'm sure by the end of our session, I'm going to be charged up again. <laughs> uh, I was in office until now, and that was the reason why today we pushed our live stream by 10 minutes. Uh, I was on a shoot. I, I mean, I'd gone to Mumbai for a shoot, and one day work gone is equal to oh my god, it brings in a lot of extra work for the next day. So have been struggling to complete my work, started my day at 9 in the morning and uh, left my office at almost 9.25. So uh, that was the reason why I just came running and I was like, finally started the live stream, <laughs> right? But as usual, whenever I interact with you all, uh, always gives me an a different level of energy. Kya baat hai? Uh, fantastic. Okay. Uh, so today we are live on multiple platforms is what I understand uh, doing a live on YouTube, LinkedIn, Twitter and Insta simultaneously. Kya baat hai? Mada gaya. Okay, Chalo. so uh, before we move on, as usual, a warm welcome to all our new members. Who are the new members? Dipesh, Kiret, Neeraj, Shubham, Basavraj, Hardik, uh, Jayesh, Odumbar, Viji, Odumbar again. Or maybe Odumbar has upgraded the membership. Those who are new uh, for the, uh, those who are new to the channel, um, these memberships are like different membership. Uh, like basically, YouTube pay. We have three levels of membership: student, investor, pro investor. Uh, the best one is pro investor. Trust me, because that is where I discuss one stock in absolute analysis. You get an opportunity to understand how to analyze, how to study a company from multiple sectors. Okay, that is the intent of our pro investor membership. Uh, <laughs> Chintan, thank you so much. Chintan says, have dinner. No time for dinner right now. Uh, but I had beer in the evening. Okay. Anyways, so uh, today, <laughs> now I'm also getting a few more answers. Ice cream with hubby after stream will make you fit, fine and happy. But first, after interacting with you all, everyone on our stream makes me feel more Actions speak louder than words, full stop. Okay. Chalo, but today, maybe because people are watching me on multiple streams, is that the reason why number of viewers on YouTube is less? I don't know. Uh, barely 1,000 people watching live. Um, so if your friends have not yet joined in, ping them too, uh, so that they also join our stream. Today, we are going to have two amazing sets of discussions. Number one, we are going to understand about Nifty levels, which I did not discuss, I think, in the last two sessions. <laughs> Everyone is behind my ice cream only. Samir says mango ice cream. Yeah, yeah, I know it. It is going to be mango ice cream. And Himanji says, Namaskar Rashna ji. Thank you, Himanji. Thank you. Namaskar. All right. Uh, so today, two things to be discussed. Number one, we are going to understand about the Nifty levels. And number two, we are going to understand about one sector, which is painting the industry red. Okay, so we're going to discuss two very amazing things today. So let's get started with the Nifty analysis first. And uh, let me present my screen for that. Um, okay, share screen, entire screen. All right. Okay, where is my screen? Okay, yes. That is Nifty for you and has been in an upward ranging trajectory since what since 28th jan 2024 <coughs> almost a month it has been in kind of a range bound zone but of course a range which wherein we are getting at least higher lows okay this was a previous low then we got a higher low even if i'm talking about highs this was a high, Uske baat ka ye high tha. now the big question is can it break this zone now to break this zone it needs to go beyond 22,400 plus if that be so, kya baat hai? this can trigger a fresh breath of air in Nifty possible. Now, what is the what is the good part today? You can see that today we had a very nice candle. We saw classic recovery from the day's lows, almost from 21,880 as a, as a lowest point. Of course, being an expiry, that was there was a big short covering because of which the markets you know rallied in no time. You should have seen 15 minutes candle today. Zap zap zap, it went up like anything. Even if you check the overall structure right now, uh, for in the day day candle scene, you can see that RSI is barely around 62. That's a good sign. 60 is not 
very high 60 is like picking up pace and that's that's a good sign even if you see mcd there has already been a crossover and it is going higher one more good thing that has happened is nifty this time since monday has again gone in the bullish zone okay super trend basically okay so super trend is in green that is again a positive sign uh, even if you check uh, basic 21 days moving average that is where nifty took a support today you can see beautifully the 21 days moving average was honored and after that it saw a very nice recovery are we above even the 50 days moving average yes are we way above the 200 days moving average yes so all in all i personally believe believe that the overall trend in nifty is intact uh, if you remember last thursday i had said <coughs> that no uh, you know magical move is expected i'm not saying that it would break out of any range or what uh, but still week on week almost 0.8% up was good enough still yet to cross this upper end and that is what i'm waiting for if that be so if that is done with conviction then kya baat hai it will be a, a next set of fresh rally and uh, it will be really really interesting to watch how nifty performs in that fresh rally okay uh, so all in all that was about the nifty levels uh, so we are going to uh, talk about uh, the sector that uh, is is what we have decided for today but before we move on with the sectoral analysis uh i got a very important point in the chat section right now jahan pe mera dhyan bhatak gaya chintan is asking are you up for the awards under education category very very important discussion being brought up by chintan are you aware about this by the way uh, nifty ka to i hope everyone understood uh, but are you aware any uh, about what is this that chintan is referring to and if not i would want everyone to understand and uh, you know a small request from my side today uh, today uh, acha people are saying yes many people acha a lot of people also saying are no we don't know about it okay chalo so i'll quickly tell you what is this all about this is the first time that our government is going to have national awards so typically you know national awards are there for films so you get a best movie as a national award best actor national award best actress national award but this is the first time that creators are going to be awarded by the government okay uh, so they they have kept multiple categories for these creators so i would just want to present my screen uh, are kya baat hai ajay is saying ma'am i have voted for you wa 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 thank you ajay and that is what i am going to request everyone to do if you feel that i am trying my level best to increase financial awareness in india i don't think i need to convince you all you all are are, are pro members you all know what we all are doing together not only i am doing this effort by myself you all are with me in this journey so i don't feel this is my journey it's not my lone journey it's the journey that we are doing together it's our uh, common effort it's our common goal that we are wanting to achieve and for that uh, what i am going to do is i'll tell you in which category can you nominate me uh, and for that i want to share my screen because uh, there is a little bit of uh, work that needs to be done i'm sharing my screen right now to lo otp il to de bye bye okay um chalo so okay the, so this is this is the overall uh, you know website that our government has created this is a national creator award celebrating your impact and these are the categories so i have nominated myself for uh, best creator in education category okay this is the first nomination that i have done for myself second best creator for social change so here it says creating advocate uh, creator advocating for social cause inclusivity empowerment and positive change and that's what i feel i do uh, for positive change for social cause inclusivity but it's financial inclusion and the third one is disruptor of the year where ch- creators who challenge the status quo it was said that uh, you know women in finance were not really taken up seriously i i started as a content creator back in 2019 and many of you might not know a lot of stories in my first year of being a creator i used to get this acha aapko kuch aata bhi hai kya ladkiya ho aapko finance ke bare mein aata hai kya first learn maths 
first learn how to juggle with numbers and then teach us okay all this i've taken in the initial years so uh, you know but you have to just get over this if you want to really achieve your end goal so what you need to do is you need to just log in so let us say uh, you can select the category here i'm going to paste this link in the chat box right now i'm just going to paste this Pooja, you can also paste this and i'm um, oh, wait let me just pin this as well pin okay i've pinned this everyone please uh, please vote using this link uh, let me get back to uh, this so full name let us say i'm filling on behalf of let us say one of my team member and her name is kimaya who handles my phone uh 90221 that is my office uh my office number you need a uh, login for that Uh, 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 uh. Please give me a second. Thank you. Okay. So, all right. So you need to fill in the details. You need to fill in your email ID, uh, gender, age state okay after that as i mentioned you can nominate me in three categories uh first one is uh where is it best creator in the education category you have to describe the work that you feel i have done and uh, oh sorry this is applicant for self sorry sorry this is nomination for others oh, oh so for you it is easy i thought you have to write so many things okay so you have to write the email idea uh, very important huh? I filled up a lot of details. I had to first tell why I deserve this and it took a lot of time. But for you, it is comparatively easy. So don't go for application for self. Go for the nominator for other category. And here you can enter your email ID. So for example, I'm writing support at the rate rachnaranade.com and you can fill in the full name, or select gender. And let us say you are wanting to, uh, you know, nominate me for the disruptor of the year then uh, creator for social change and education category three categories uh, nominees primary platform hi so you can uh, put youtube here uh, you can paste or you will have to go to my channel and uh, my link is here anyways but it's youtube youtube.com slash at the rate rachna ranade okay you can go to my channel that's you will find the link there Okay, how uh, it's it's pretty easy, right? YouTube.com slash at the rate C A Rachana Ranade. Okay, and you can quote the number of followers as 4.75 million. Uh, by the way, this is YouTube, and then second highest is Instagram. Uh, that is my Instagram link. Of course, you can easily copy that. Uh, what I will do is I will paste all these details in my comments in the pinned comment. Best in the I'll have a proper pinned comment in which I'll tell you which. Uh, uh, what are so you'll have to this i will not write name and all but nomination category and creator profile these details i will put up in the pinned comment requesting everyone to please nominate me in this category and uh, you know if if i get this uh, award if i get selected uh, there are great chances it is said that either our president or the prime minister may hand over the awards it will be a dream come true, uh, let me tell you. Uh, because, you know, uh, of course, uh, who doesn't like to be appreciated? <laughs> I'm not any Sant category person. Uh, uh, of course, I, I don't do my work so that someone recognizes my work. Absolutely not. But in my process, anyways, I'm going to keep on working. I'm going to keep on uh, doing whatever it takes to increase financial literacy in India. But in that journey, if someone even gives a pat on the back, uh, feels good uh, whenever you give some positive comments feel good feels good and if it is recognized by the government wow or kya hi chahiye, so jata hai, right so uh, please do find time to nominate me 26th february is the last date okay doesn't mean that you have to fill it on the 26th of february you can do that even after the live stream by tomorrow also you can do that uh, award mila to party to banega is what bharat says yes party denge kyun nahi denge ravi ji saying you will win ma'am kya baat hai thank you thank you FM is woman, so how could anybody doubt you in 2019? <laughs> I know, I know, but people who doubt have the ability to doubt and keep on doubting. Okay, 
So, uh, anyways, uh, again, just a small request. Please, 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 requesting everyone to vote for me in the categories that I discussed right now. Okay, with that, let us go to uh, today's discussion. Very interesting discussion. Took a long time to uh, get some meaningful data. And today's discussion is about the paint industry. Okay, now uh, when I was just going through uh, some specific points, uh, I realized, so, you know, I was just typically every day I keep on going through certain charts. Okay. And uh, today it struck me that there are some, by the way, if you have read about the news today, uh, and can anyone tell me the news about Grasim? Anyone? Achha, Hemanji is saying nomination done. Kya baat hai, Hemanji? That was super fast. Thank you. Okay. Uh, anyone, did you read about Grasim? Ha, thank you, thank you. Everyone is saying, ma'am, you will win. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yes, Sai Prasanna says, Grasim in paint industry. And that is what Evil King Gaming says. Okay. Um, they are coming big way in paint industry. Absolutely, absolutely. Entered in paint industry. Kya baat hai? Very nice. Trinap says, Grasim is entering to become second largest paint company. Fantastic. Okay, so with all these points, I when I read that in the news today, today I just thought of analyzing the charts of various paint companies. Okay. And I realized a, a very, you know, typical pattern in all the paint stocks. Okay. So believe it or not, but they have not given great returns in the last few years. Okay. Of course, this is backed by data. I would want to share my screen for this. So uh, <clears throat> if you can see here, this is Asian Paints chart. This is monthly time frame. Here you can see it is completely going in the sideways trend. Okay. And if you see here, this uh, high around 34, 3500 was around mid June, uh, I mean, around June, June 21 ish, 2021. I'm talking about or June, July, whatever. Came down, again went up, came down, again went up. So it has been in the absolute sideways trend. Asian Paints, no, I mean, not at all amazing returns, absolute side, sideways trend for Asian paints. Even if you check Kansai Nerolek, Kansai Nerolek is trading comparatively below its 52 week high. So 52 week high was around 2021 and it was around 450 plus levels. And even today, it is nowhere close to its all time high. It is uh, around 350 levels. Okay. If you check Berger paints, again, 52 week high around 2021, somewhere 700 plus. And today was around 571. So again, pretty much lower as compared to its 52-week high. Indigo paints, even though there is a sharp recovery uh, from the lowest most point, just see the downfall. So all in Acha, and one more. Chalo, Exo, Exo Noble also we have taken. But Exo Noble, if you see here from if I'm comparing it with 2020, then it has done better. 2020 high was around 2500. Uh, this high, this month's high was a shade above 3000 shalimar paints also uh this this all-time high came somewhere around 2017 2018 which was 230 cash pass and right now it's around 200 ish 196 okay so all in all i can say that these companies so by the way you might be like why did i take these names uh just just for your uh understanding if you check by market share I did discuss Asian Paints, I did discuss Berger, Kansai Nerola, Exo Noble. I discussed Shalimar Paints and uh, Indigo in the others category. Okay, what, why others category, I'll tell you. Market leader in paint segment is Asian Paints with almost uh, 59-60% market share. Okay, I'll share exact stats also afterwards. So, uh, Asian Paints around 59-60% as a market share. Okay, leader by a great margin. Second highest is Berger with around 18 to 20% share. Third one is Kansai Narolek with around 15% share. Okay. Fourth one is Exo Noble around 6-7% share. And fifth is others category. Okay. So all in all, I what I did was uh, all these charts that I showed you were of top players. I have not included Grassim right now because their sales are yet to kick off. Okay. I will tell you when, when, what, Everything they're going to, that is what the stream is today, right? But that is the reason why I have not taken Grassim right now. Uh, what is 
the exact name of that brand everything we are going to discuss okay but all in all you have to understand that paint industry may there are two key things that you need to understand the first key thing i'm sure many people would work, would actually know uh, number one i would ask a question to everyone what is that component in the raw material cost which accounts for a huge percentage can anyone tell me what is that expenditure for paint industry which accounts for a huge percentage in their raw material cost crude kya baat hai many many of them have given correct answer amounts are crazy higher than 50% is only crude okay so huge huge factor is of crude because ultimately paint to to manufacture paint crude is one of the key raw materials okay now one more cost which many paint companies incur and this you you are going to be taken by surprise there are many companies who allocate almost 5% of their sales budget for one specific cost i'm repeating almost 5% of their total sales budget some big company like asian paints they allocate only for one specific line item in pnl and if i'm talking about comparatively smaller companies like the jsw paints indigo paints nippon all these will contribute to around 15 to i mean all all these companies would have around 15 to 20% of their sales budget for this point kya baat hai i'm so happy that our channel viewers are now pro superb superb and i would want to show first five six answers ankit is correct somitra is correct pavandeep is correct raj gopal is correct rohit pramod uh, ravi uh, Ra- rams uh, chandra uh, rajendra sushant kya baat hai so almost all of these people have given correct answers it is marketing okay it is advertisement now typically why we have to understand the reason for that as well okay every thursday we have to have a new learning okay why do they spend so much on advertising and marketing because people like you and me who at least at least me who doesn't have an expertise in you know paint selection i don't really understand that this shade of gray and that shade of gray and uh, वन पेंट वन आम्ही मराठी ते एक हात बास आहे का दोन हात बास आहे वन लेअर ऑफ पेंट इज इनफ टू लेअर ऑफ पेंट इज इनफ वॉट आय डोंट अंडरस्टँड इंटिग्रिटीज ओके बट देन आय वुड से दॅट ओ धोनी इज ॲडवर्टायझिंग फॉर दिस कॅन बी गुड ओ आलिया भट इज ॲडवर्टायझिंग कॅन बी गुड रणवीर सिंग इज ॲडवर्टायझिंग कॅन बी गुड ओके सो वील प्ले अ क्विक क्विज राईट नाव लेट मी सी इफ यू नो द ब्रँड अम्बॅसिडर्स ऑफ दीज पेंट कंपनीज ओके चलो फटाफट लेट मी सी हू गिव्स आन्सर्स फर्स्ट टू पीपल आन्सरिंग दिस फर्स्ट थ्री पीपल आन्सरिंग दिस आई वांट टू शो योर नेम्स ऑन द स्क्रीन ओके फर्स्ट वन इज बर्जर पेंट्स हु इज द ब्रांड एंबेसडर बर्जर पेंट्स फटाफट नो नॉट एसआरके बर्जर पेंट्स धोनी का दोन्ही दोन्ही नाहीये बर्जर पेंट्स झेब्रा कसं काय सुशांत म्हणतोय तुम्ही काही विचारा ना मला ज्याचं उत्तर माहिती तेच मी देणार शाबास येस अक्षय इज गिव्हन द करेक्ट आन्सर अँड हिज नेम ओनली हॅज द आन्सर इट इज अक्षय कुमार क्या बात आहे सो फॉर बर्जर द आन्सर इज करेक्ट इट इज अक्षय कुमार सेकंड क्वेश्चन इज कन्साई नेरोलॅक हू कॅन गिव्ह मी द आन्सर कन्साई नेरोलॅक हू इज द ब्रँड अम्बॅसिडर झाला अक्षय कुमार आता कन्साई नेरोलॅक फटाफट वाटेल ती नाव घेत आहे तुम्ही क्रिस्टियानो रोनाल्डो काय बरे ना तब्येत रणवीर रणवीर सिंग ओके कुल नेक्स्ट वन ऍटलिस्ट अच्छा सो ऑफकोर्स देर आर कॉन्ट्रॅक्च्युअल अग्रीमेंट दे मे चेंज फ्रॉम इयर टू इयर क्वाईट पॉसिबल ओके येस करेक्ट करेक्ट दॅट इज द करेक्ट आन्सर but everyone uh, so let let us also say in latest ads also that could be also one more criteria okay latest ads okay uh, next one is asian paints two three people have appeared latest ads me asian paints so we could have a little bit more answers here 
झालं रणवीर सिंग और आता यस आज इविल किंग तो एकदम मतलब प्रो हो गए दीपिका पदुकोण एब्सोल्युटली राजेश हॅज ऑल्सो गिव्हन द करेक्ट आन्सर इट इज दीपिका पदुकोण यस 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 एब्सोल्युटली क्या बात है क्या बात है फैंटास्टिक ओके चलो लास्ट वन जे एस डब्ल्यू पेंट्स एव्हरी वन नोज धोनी केली धोनी इज फॉर इंडिगो पेंट्स एव्हरी वन नोज दॅट जे एस डब्ल्यू पेंट्स लास्ट वन फटाफट जे एस डब्ल्यू पेंट्स एव्हरी वन इज सर्चिंग नाव एव्हरी जे एस डब्ल्यू पेंट्स माय गेट अ डाऊट आज अचानक से सर्च क्यू हो रहा आपण नाम येस फटाफट लॉंग टाइम वी हॅड दिस क्विक क्वेश्चन अँड आन्सर क्या बात आहे मेनी पीपल आर ऑल्सो कमेंटिंग थ्रू लिंक इन सो वेलकमिंग ऑल दोज हू आर कमेंटिंग थ्रू लिंक इन एज वेल ऑल राईट सो let's move on with that okay so first and foremost we have understood that this is an industry where a lot of budgets are kept for advertising and the reason might be simple like i said maybe when customers don't really understand the nitty gritties of that product they just understand a paint lagana hai paint karna hai bas that's it they know uh, in that case the brand ambassador might impact the decision making of the customer and that might be the reason why they really are in a race to hire or they are in a race to get the best person to advertise for them okay but that is about marketing advertising now let's understand about the expected growth trajectory in this industry uh, what are the capex plans uh, so all in all growth trajectory of the paint industry is projected to ease is what one of the report i read which was about care ratings okay so this is on careratings.com you can visit careratings.com and check uh, for this uh i checked it from a report page number 1 and 4 ye bhi bata deti hu and in the synopsis they have mentioned that the growth trajectory of the indian paint industry is projected to ease with an expected expansion of 9 to 10% in financial year 24 okay but they are saying even if it eases a little bit operating profit margins may improve from 1% to 2% okay but other than that there are some important points that capex planned in next 3 to 4 years to increase competitive intensity what i understood i'm going to sum up at the end but right now just understand the capex that top 5 players are doing top 5 players are doing a capacity at around 4.22 million kiloliters per annum as of fy23 the, so even if you don't understand how many kiloliters okay forget that uh, for a second the industry has planned a capex of around 20 to 22000 crore rupees over the next 3 to 4 years i'm repeating almost 20 to 22000 crore rupees of capital expenditure acha what do i mean by capital expenditure new new plants will be set up okay new factories will be set up that is capital expenditure 20 to 22000 crore rupees are going to be invested in new plant new machinery new factory okay and out of this money 10000 crores almost 50% of that is planned only by grasim okay whatever is the industry level capex 20 to 22000 that is industry level capex out of that 10000 crore is planned only by grasim followed by asian paints which is 8750 crores okay so that tells us that oh, are baap re there's going to be a big uh, thing that is going to start in the paint industry everyone is wanting to increase their capacity now uh, we have to understand one more important correlation of the paint industry with the gdp of a country okay you can also check this out uh, there are multiple news articles here also it is said that growth rate of paint sector has typically exhibited 1.5 to 2 times of correlation with india's gdp growth matlab if india's gdp growth happens at 6% okay then typically growth of paint sector will be 1.5 to 2 times of that so if india's gdp growth rate is 6% then paint sector should grow from 9 to 12% okay is india's gdp expected to grow yes at a good rate yes uh, obviously paint industry growth overall growth i'm talking about top line is that expected to grow yes 
and if that be so if supply can be projected i mean sorry if demand can be projected by the companies we are able to understand also if gdp is growing then pain demand should also increase if that be so we should be ready with the capacity and that is that might be the reason why huge capacity expansion is planned by big players okay now if that be so that is a positive side agreed but you have to also understand one or two nitty gritties and for that i'm going to share my chart okay i want everyone to focus on one important data point that i'm going to present right now have a look at this okay this of course all these data points have been taken from public uh, available documents some from the management com uh, management con call some from the investor presentation okay this is or some from the credit rating agencies ka reports which is again available online okay so this is about sales of top 5 companies in paint industry so the, what are the what is the point that we are going to understand what we are focusing right now is the sales increasing that is first question we, that we are trying to understand so if you see here as compared to financial year 19 to 20 to 21 to 22 see the green gra bar graphs is it increasing yes okay this is this is the total of sales of top 5 companies in the paint industry Now, if you ask me which are the top 5 indian paint industry related companies for that have a look at this chart this is what i was trying to tell you okay asian paints has a share of 59% huge right second one burger 18% third consign airline for exonobel and fifth one is others directly okay but wait birla upas is what you will now get to see within no time i guess and that is going to eat up some chunk here okay uh, now going back to this chart if you see here sales of top 5 companies is growing in absolute numbers it is growing but if you see percentage increase in sale percentage increase in sales say numbers are increasing but by what percent that percent went up from 3% to 5% to 31% was oh, such a big jump are base year was low na during covid people were not busy painting their house okay that was an industry which also faced a lot of pain okay because paint industry was not doing that great at that point in time and that is why this huge jump okay but then if you see sales growth from 31% to 19% to 10% oh oh so top five companies is their sales growing yes but their share in sales is growing is going down question is who is eating up the share in that case which could be the next competitor and of course we are going to discuss about that which is going to be no doubts it has to be grasil and uh, what i would again want to do acha stop sharing the screen one minute i would share the screen again and today i have taken this as a screenshot from uh, this is again available on their website only this is aditya birla ka website from there only i have taken a screenshot and this one says birla i want to read this out everyone please pay attention huh? birla opus has six strategically located fully automated integrated and global scale manufacturing plants so many of you might have read the news about six manufacturing plants that grasim has installed for has come up with for the capacity expansion many people don't know this that have all six become operational or not wait we'll understand that okay and how much is going to be the total commercial capacity 1332 million liters per annum a quantum leap of 40% addition to the current industry capacity wow wow whatever is the current industry capacity uska direct 40% addition is going to be brought in by grasim okay now you'll be like hey yeah, grasim is entering into paint from where are they going to find so much distribution see for a company for a product like paints okay you need classic distribution let i'm going to stop sharing my screen i i i want to see how many of you can give a correct answer answer is not that difficult please pay attention if you want to sell something like paints okay you need good distribution does grasim have a good distribution and if yes of which product does grasim of aditya birla group do they have a good distribution based on which they are banking or based on which they are going so much full into capacity shambhu says cement and yes correct answer is cement anurag has also given the correct answer ultratech ultratech are oh kya baat hai many people are giving cement uh, ultratech kya baat hai cement fantastic fantastic many people are giving the answer yes 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 kya baat hai fantastic absolutely now you can imagine the reach of ultratech cement okay and if that be so 
with the reach of ultra dex cement if they are also able to plug in are ghar banayenge whenever a house is going to be constructed cement is going to be used along with cement if they are able to push paint kya baat hai that can really bring in some disruption in the paint industry that is possible okay so going back to this screenshot that i've taken from aditya birla website only that six uh six globe global scale manufacturing plants they are going to add a 40% addition to the overall industry capacity only panipat ludhiana cheyar okay birla opus plants were dedicated to the nation today means who are fully operational out of see out of six three fully operational chamarajanagar sorry if i have pronounced it long, wrongly chamarajanagar correct mahad and karakpur units will commence production over the course of financial year 25 okay so this will take some time so this is basically next financial year okay all six manufacturing plants are fully sustainable la, 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 la. okay okay fantastic zero defect and going there now next next paragraph is also this is taken again from the same presentation niche tha i pasted it here only birla opus products will be available in punjab haryana and tamil nadu from mid march 24 from next month punjab haryana tamil nadu from mid march 24 so they'll start selling their products starting next month and across 1 lakh population towns in india by july 2024 and what they have done in so the company aims to expeditiously expand its distribution to over 6000 towns by the end of fiscal year end and this will be the that is what they have written in bold i have not done this in bold this is what they have done in bold on their website this will be the fastest and widest pan india launch by any paint brand hmm now if that be so do you think that this can create a disruption do you think that it can create a disruption absolutely it can okay now you can imagine overall anyways right now asian paint was one market leader but others were struggling with the next next biggest market share now a big player has entered and with this capacity with the sales that they bring in they might be the second highest they will even overtake the second highest which currently is burger so it will be asian paints then grasim then burger then consigner like then as well right so if that be so can that really bring in some disruption answer is yes okay so uh, this is this is going to be some different level thing what my perception is i'll tell you so last one one or two minutes in this entire discussion maximum attention i want what does it mean number one is the overall paint industry set to grow yes why like i told if gdp grows paint industry will grow 1.5 to 2 times of the overall gdp number one okay paint industry will grow agreed second will the sale numbers also go up yes but number three to compete for the market share many companies may also think about cutting their prices okay if that be so their top line is going to go down right they may cut prices so that they can bring in more sales uh in fact i remember reading this if i can just get, yes in this year only burger has dropped their price by 1% asian paints about 1.3% already okay one point so their price is decreasing price will decrease second one is overall inflationary pressure on the raw material crude oil price that is not in anyone's hand if that keeps on increasing they will have to bear the brunt of that third marketing costs are going to go higher so overall what i feel that even the top line may be good the the operational profit or profit before tax that can get squeezed in a little bit is what i feel for the coming few quarters slash one or two years uh, what i can correlate this with is when in certain sector a lot of competition comes in okay uh you can imagine something this this happened in telecom also big players entering in telecom and after a long time uh, one or two major players are now remaining in telecom same thing happened with air, airlines a lot of competition now only one or two major players i think this excessive players coming in ka ye jo phase hota hai this phase is what paint industry is seeing right now and in this to there are also 
unorganized sector players which are again you know they eat up a huge chunk of the overall market so one there is unorganized market second there is organized market in that also a lot of competition is is coming into play so it will be really interesting to watch this sector and uh, what what we uh, just what one last slide that i would want to show everyone quickly i'll just share my entire screen um so i did share all these uh, graphs with you all uh, shalimar paint so overall similar to previous highs then uh, i did talk about exonobel above its pre just above previous highs indoco paints to kafi niche hai burger paints also is down kansai narolek is down asian paints sideways what we did today uh, try to do a custom paint index okay so basically if you remember last time we did cnx auto so we tried to analyze the auto index but auto index is ready made it's available na auto index is available it index is available bank index is available there is no paint index as such can we create an index we can okay so we have created this index using asian paint consignero lac exo burger paint uh, Shal shalimar paints all these put together if we see that overall it is not that bad but if i check the previous highs this was around 1372 it is pretty much closer to that right now so all in all okay rising trend but not very very you know uh, mind blowing category okay so uh, let's see uh, i'll just quickly repeat uh, i feel that overall uh, paint industry top line i don't feel any pain but margin side i see some pain coming in okay so please tell me if you liked this kya baat hai anup says love for custom paint index kya baat hai thank you paint it red <laughs> so last <clears throat> 40 minutes i have been talking one way 1700 people on the live stream and 600 people have liked it uh kya baat hai anand says that's really creative of your custom index of pins thank you uh people smash the like button and uh, today i have also told you that please find time to nominate me also so two things today uh Trina is saying, "Ma'am, Asian paints future question mark." Uh, so I don't see. Finally, it's a market leader. It's not going to go. It's going to get. It's not going to get blown away just like that. But uh, you have to understand that they will have to face some good competition from new entrants now, and I'm sure they will also come up with cer certain marketing strategies or whatever. So let's see how they react to that. Okay. Okay, Ajay says, "Ma'am, Dream Folks, despite having such a good business prospect, FIs are reducing stake." Uh, Ajay, I've done a separate video on Dream Folks, uh, wherein I've uh, told various reasons why this stock was in a correction. Uh, so please watch that video. Pooja, if you can find the link of Dream Folks uh, video, please uh, share that in in the comment section. And he's saying, "Zensar, big cup and handle in weekly." Let me see if your uh, view point. your observation is right zensar is it a cup and handle pattern let me see on a weekly candle right oh yes it is a weekly candle i'm sorry uh, oh yes it is a cup and handle guys <laughs> alamala it is a cup and handle pattern so you can very clearly see here one minute let me just draw this quickly this is the cup this is the handle it did break out but right now it did so i'll just zoom this in did break out but it so as per cup and handle pattern this is a crucial level okay the lower most point of the handle hopefully it does not break this okay uh, again anyone who is oh did i did i share oh i forgot to present extremely sorry one minute let me share the entire screen um this is this is the weekly candle for zensar cup handle did it break out yes it did break out try to retest but in fact went below uh, the level or you may also say this could be a potential level uh, struggling near this level for last 3 4 weeks it should not breach this level as per cup and handle pattern uh, and uh, this is the 
observation and yes who who was the one who asked the question ajay your observation is correct it is a cup and handle pattern just in case uh, there are people who are viewing our live stream for the very first time uh, this is a platform where you can share your observations uh, if you feel that you know i observed this pattern uh, one more example kya baat hai karun arora ma'am as per share as per nahi no, ma'am as you share pull and flag pattern in pfcrc after this correction in both the stocks is the pattern still intact or not okay so uh, we someone had asked in the previous live stream about pfc and rec let me take example of rec limited both almost go hand in hand like a mirror image so let me go back to the daily candle and i will share are baap re the if the line hai thamba zara one minute you will get a clear picture okay um share screen and tap screen okay now if you see here someone uh, in the previous live stream had asked about poland flag pattern yes this is a poland flag pattern i'll just quickly extend this so that you understand this is it still testing the upper end of the flag it is okay as per poland flag pattern this is the danger level the halfway through of the flag it's nowhere closer to that okay and it has to close below this on a daily basis so that you know as per this uh, you know flag and pole pattern it then is treated as one of the stop loss levels okay does this mean i'm telling you that this is the target and this is the stop loss no absolutely not we are here to learn what are the different chart patterns as per technical analysis whatever are your observations about certain uh, candlestick patterns or chart patterns i'm just helping you to reiterate i'm your teacher you are asking me questions i'm just answering your queries right all right rajesh says bbl stock sitting with 96% profit average price 745 their capex plan is changing my mind not to book even partial profits your view please i think uh, rajesh bbl varun beverages was the stock that i discussed as my birthday stock and uh, unfortunately i am still not invested in that i'm not invested right now in my portfolio feel bad but i'm happy for you <laughs> okay uh, so i mean yes it's it's doing very well and it's in the blue sky zone almost right now so enjoy enjoy your journey rajesh uh, and i'm i'm glad that you have also checked their capex plans that is how people of our channel are different right you also check capex plans you also check balance sheets and investor presentations fantastic okay so it is it is i mean i mean th that stock is obviously a blue sky zone uh, it's let me also quickly share uh, my screen let me see the numbers also uh, about their quarterly numbers exact varun uh, beverage is limited quarterly numbers quarterly sales growth this is more of uh, you know uh, what do we say seasonal business okay so check for december uh, 1734 crores to 2214 crores to 2668 crores kya baat hai increasing trend uh, operating profit margin has cooled off a little bit but that's what i can see in december also uh, it, in fact it, it is at the highest right now is what i see december uh, 13% to 12% to 14% to 16% kya baat hai and finally pbt from minus 19 to plus 42 crores to plus 90 crores to 188 crores oh my god kya baat hai enjoy rajesh <laughs> enjoy is what i can say okay sai says rachna ji bank of baroda is making higher high with good potential and has not done much compared to other stocks in psu basket your thoughts please in fact <clears throat> uh, sai uh, i had discussed about bank of baroda and sbi <coughs> i had discussed based on the financials during our diwali uh, live stream also uh, i think i had done one live stream on how psu banks are performing and in that also i have discussed about bank of baroda uh, how how the technical uh, chart is there for bank of baroda also the numbers uh, again would want to quickly present my screen uh bank of baroda what does if you see here revenue at all time high oops sorry revenue at all time high financing profit at all time high 
look at the turnaround from minus 3000 one, minus 1300 minus 3400 minus 1600 minus 30 all in crores uh, to three digit positive once or twice here and again back to 1484 positive uh, pbt also pretty much good so all in all i mean bank of baroda numbers also look pretty interesting right uh, one or two last questions it's 10 30 already or 10 32 okay zomato rounding bottom let me check zomato Let's check on a weekly time frame. Oh ho, oh ho. Interesting. Kya baat hai? Who's that? Vamshi Krishna. Oh wow, your handstand is also very nice, huh, Vamshi? I can only stand. You can do a handstand. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. Who else is other Kaitri Pantu Joku Stat Madit? Thamdara. So, madam, see. I remove this old cup and handle. Okay. This is one level. Okay. This was like <clears throat> intra month all time high. It's trying to test that right now. Let's see how the month closes. But yes, um, <clears throat> typically rounding bottom candidates are for a little bit higher number of years. As per uh, technical analysis, it's like if it's like uh, six, seven years, the rounding bottom is amazing. This is more or less like a three years uh, rounding bottom. Uh, doesn't fit into the textbook definition per se. But yes, I may say thoda sir. Okay. Agreed. Uh, okay. Just last, oh, last one or two quick questions. Done for the day almost. Oh, ho. Ranji ji says, PM Narendra Modi will lay the foundation of stone for redevelopment work at more than 554 railway stations under Amrit Bharat station scheme on 26 February through video conference. Keep a watch. Kya baat hai? Good input, Ranji ji. Okay. Prasanna. I'm your six same club member. Kya baat hai? Long, long time ago. That was during COVID uh, 2020. Proud. Thank you. On Bajaj Finance, I know, I know. I mean, a lot of people, when it comes to Bajaj Finance, Bajaj Pinsar, um, it has been going in a very much sideways trend. Uh, not, not so happy with the performance right now, to be honest. Uh, I will just share my screen. One minute. I actually thought of making a separate video on this. Maybe next month I will try and find some time uh, to do a video on this. Uh, this one. Hmm. Just have a look at this. This is like 2021. One, two, almost there. Four, five. It's not able to cut that. Uh, again. Again, you know, competition in that space also may be coming in. But this this stock has not been able to do well. Uh, so we'll try my level best person to do a separate video on the Bajaj Twin Towers. Bajaj Finance, Bajaj Pinsar. Okay. 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 I think that is it. I'm done for the day. Thank you. <laughs> it's always fun, uh, you know, interacting with you all. Uh, today uh, was a day when we discussed about not only Nifty, we did discuss, achha, one one last word. Indus Tower has made cup and handle formation uh, on weekly, daily charts, target suggested by formation. Uh, okay. Indus, I'll, I'll check for whether it's a cup and handle pattern or not uh, for Indus Towers. Okay. Last question, huh? I had not taken Hemanji's question for a long time. Ask Lelia question. Yes, if I'm checking the weekly time frame, it's the handle has not yet been formed. It's more or less like just a cup. 
it's like a kullad right now uh, handle is missing okay so let's see okay i hope everyone enjoyed today's live stream uh, we did a discussion on not only nifty levels but we also discussed about the paint industry did you enjoy yes or no quickly share in the comment section if you loved the stream and if you have still not smashed the like button please do that enjoy the ice cream <laughs> oh my god i'm not sure when am i going to control myself i should not be having ice cream like every thursday uh, i'll just keep on put <laughs> putting on more and more weight uh, but yes we'll we'll try my level best but as to control nahi ho payega i've been working for more than 12 hours now i need ice cream <laughs> okay so kya uh, baat everyone is saying yes i liked it we liked it please explain knr construction agli bar santosh okay uh, are part saying not taken my question as well since long time never mind we'll continue to wait for upcoming live streams for my questions to be taken as well par ab bhi dekha tumhara question sorry uh, next time yes <laughs> all right all right kai hot nahi chalta manta hai lok kya baat hai okay chalo i'll see you all uh, need a blog on reliance please okay notes noted noted okay bajaj finance bajaj finser yes yes we'll do that ओके जाऊ द्या आता मला जाऊ द्या घरी आता घरीच म्हणजे मी पण मला आता जाऊ द्या ओके धन्यवाद आय होप एव्हरी वन एन्जॉय टुडेज लाईफ स्ट्रीम आय सी ओ नेक्स्ट थर्सडे एम आय गोइंग टू बी आउट ऑफ टाउन येस नेक्स्ट थर्सडे आय विल नॉट बी इन पुणे सो विल नॉट बी एबल टू कंडक्ट द लाईफ स्ट्रीम नेक्स्ट थर्सडे प्लीज एक्सक्यूज मी फॉर दॅट सो आय विल सी यू डिरेक्टली आफ्टर टू वीक्स दॅट इज ऑन द सेवन्थ ऑफ मार्च नाव डायरेक्टली डायरेक्टली ऑन सेवन्थ ऑफ मार्च uh i'll miss you all uh, but keep your study going keep your analysis right and uh, i'll see you on next to next thursday till then take care shahin bye bye don't forget to vote for me eh? link in pin comments bye <laughs>